All right, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It's Tragic Life here with the Final Fantasy IV The After Years. Uh, we are in the middle of Palom's um, storyline, and we just met Leonora. Um, Palom is unbearably rude. I can't stand this character at the moment, and I'm sure he's going to change and we're going to like him, but, well, we'll see. Um, <clears throat> so right now that we got her, we're going to go ahead and go down... Because our destination is the Tower of Trials. Uh, before I move forward, i got to start saying this. Uh, like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what I'm doing right. Let me know what I'm doing wrong. Let me know how I can make it better. Or if you just want to talk, I'm cool with that as well. Um, let's start building this. Uh, anyway, our destination is Tower of Trials. But before we get there, because we got to get her all the way to the top floor to become an Eep. Whatever that is. That's those girls. I don't know what they are. Um, we're going to go ahead and we're probably going to grind a little bit to, because we have to get her some stuff okay thank you so we were talking about the moon system in this and how it's a big complaint for a lot of people and I, I get it um, like I want to like it it's, it's a cool concept I'll give it that. Uh, the issue for me is that I don't know if it really adds anything to the game. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm not 100% sure that it actually, like, boosts the game. So, if you want to do more than just... Wow, really? That's it? I feel like that might have been a waste. If you want to do more than just magic damage, um, you gotta buy her some stuff. So we gotta get 700 here. Um, seven, six, three, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and grind a little bit and get her some more arrows and get her the best armor. Um, we also want to get her the level 12. Um, because she's at level 3 right now, which is really weak. Um, so she's probably going to die a lot, so I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, I'm back real quick just to give you an, a good place to grind. Um, if you leave the castle and you go straight up, you'll come across a chocobo forest. Um, this is a really good place to grind, not in here but outside, because if you touch, talk to a white chocobo, you get, a, you get your magic back. Um, which really works out in the end, because then you can just cure yourself and then go get magic up. So, all right, welcome back. So, um, quick recap. Got her to level 12. Um, I changed my mind. I bought her Thunder Rod. Uh, I bought her the gear. I think it was a Wizard Hat Silver Armlet. And he is now a level 16. So, we're going to go ahead and continue forward. So, <clears throat> when you're ready, go back to the town. All right, come here. So we got to ride south. We're looking for a tower. Um, it's been a while since we've been here. Uh, I must tell you, I'm not a big fan of the... Uh, of these this combination, because she's kind of... She's really weak. She's good for healing, and that's about it. Uh, near the ship where we got off. So let's see. this way oh, there it is all right that's been a while since we've been here so this is where we're gonna go <sighs> this is gonna be fun I'm gonna try to do the whole thing guys no promises though this is this is the Tower of Trials what's on the top floor anyway the the monastic seal so you grab that come back and you're an epop. Yes. Oh great, Earth Crystal, who hath blessed us with the great bounties of the land. For the clear water and lush forest you have bequeathed us, I offer you our thanks and our prayers. 
Well, I'm glad to see you can recite your prayers at least. Yeah, yes, I, uh, 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 are you ready to go, Palum? Let's make something clear first. Y yes. Could you knock it off with that Lord Palum joke? Junk. But, but, I'm pretty sure we're the same age. Uh, I, um, I'm actually two years older than you. Oh, yeah. Good for you, but don't expect me to start calling you Miss Lenora or anything. That that's uh that that's perfectly fine with me, Lord Pelham. Like I said, enough of the Lord. Y yes, Pelham, Pelham. I'm not gonna do the stuttering for the entire time. It's gonna drive me nuts. That's better. All right. Uh, what? Well, here we are. Yes, I'm. You're right. I'm still doing the stuttering. Ready to start with your training? Certainly, please tell me what I need to do. Let's begin with the basics. That would be fire. You know what fire is. What is it? Really? It's a fire attack. Uh, yes, of course. That's it. Wait. What? That's it? Come on, Lenore. I thought they said you had talent. The first thing you need with magic is the ability to project an, an image of the magic in question. That's part of the idea behind spell transcription, too. Clear your mind and create an image of pure fire, then project it into on the reality. Wow, that's amazing. Now you do it. I'm gonna do something funny here. Apparently there's something pretty funny here. Um here's what you'll be practicing on. Now go on. Oh okay. Fire, scorching red flames. Burning brightly, the searing fire of a furnace. So, if you want some hilarity here, learn fire. So, when you cast fire, go cast it on him. Whoa, 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 watch where you're aiming. Okay, so, yeah, that's funny. All right. Her fire is weaker than the normal in fire game for whatever reason. Okay, not bad. Now let's see how well you do in a real battle. A real battle? Training has no meaning if you can't do it in real life situations, right? Can you maintain your composure and visualize that image with the monster staring you down? That's the key. Maintain your composure. Contain your main posure. What? You've lost it already, haven't you? No, I can do it. All right, let's go ahead and get the treasure chest real quick. So most of the bad guys on this floor are going to be weak to fire, so that's a plus. I think that was four skeletons. All right, I got to do this. All right, there's four more skeletons. Uh huh. A guardian, huh? Here, you try fighting this by yourself. But by by myself? Yeah, by yourself. No, go on. Mini red. Kind of adorable. Alright, that's awesome. I actually learned fire this time. Cool. Okay. I, I did it. It's nothing to be that excited about. That's just one of the building blocks you can eventually upgrade in the higher level magic. Higher level magic? Fyra and then Fyraga. Uh, the more powerful the spell, the more you'll need to concentrate your energy. 
I'll try. Of course, most people give up at this point, but... The, really? Huh, didn't think I'd see one of these. What's that? Take a look. HP and MP restore. What is it? We mages are just regular people when we run out of MP. I understand. I'll be careful about that. Let me make sure I got it for both of us. Okay. All right. Okay, so we're on... Follow the path. Take the lower passage. I missed something. Hold on. And that was both... That was two... Uh... All right, so that was two sets of skele two sets of four skeletons, and that was this fight here was three cockatrices. Um, they suck a little bit more than the uh, skeletons. All right, that was two skeletons and two blood bones. Just realized I'm gonna do something here uh, real quick. A little black magic. Uh, okay. So that little black magic, uh, Creates uh, is randomly cast a spell on one of these three ba one of the three basic elements of fire, fire, pyragra, uh, and the same for blizzard and thunder. So, yeah, it's randomly will cast one of them. All right, so I was supposed to go this way. Where are we? Right, we need magic. All right, going back upstairs. All right. Ooh, I don't think we've seen the red mooses. I'm gonna hit them with fire because they're weak to fire. I'm gonna hit them with fire, I mean. Ooh, good damage. Alright. Alright, that was three skeletons and a blood bones. Uh, uh, that was five red mooses. Uh, we got Echo Hammer and Phoenix down. Let's go ahead and cure up. How convenient. One guardian per four. You're up. M me? Well, I'm not the one in training here, am I? No, but good luck, kid. All right, it's three mini reds. It's not going to work. Oh, it might work. It worked. Cool. I did it, Lord Palom. I, I mean, Palom. Black magic is certainly harder to learn than white magic. It's not a matter of difficulty. Most people are just better suited towards one or the other. That's why you get why you get called a sage if you're master both black and white magic. Hmm. Wait a minute. That isn't what you're training to become, is it? What? Uh, of course not. Never in my wildest dreams. That's what I thought. Let's continue. All right. How about we tackle Blizzard next? You mean ice magic? Yes. Right, but don't think about ice. Think about the feeling of cold itself. The cold itself. Mm, cold air. Cold, cold, cold. You got the idea, even if you're scaring me a little.
Old cold. So we're just gonna hit it with cold. Learn Blizzard with a question mark. It's enough. There, you're starting to get it. I I think so. But there that is one seriously creepy face you're making. Alright, so really Alright, that was uh three spirits and a and a soul. They are actually we they are resistant to fire. So are bombs and there's something else. Bombs, souls and spirits. They're all weak. They're not weak to Blizzard, but they are resistant to fire. So this is a good place to use Blizzard. Okay, so which way are we going? Alright, uh... Right. right, that was three spirits and a soul again. I just learned poison. Hoping, I think I was... Alright, that was uh, five red mooses. Yeah, I was supposed to go to the go up the middle path. There's an either. That was two skeletons and two souls. Wait. Okay, that was four skeletons. Sorry, I got distracted. I didn't go the wrong way. I think I went the right way the first time. Dang it. Alright. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish this in one swing, guys. I'm going to try, but it's already 23 minutes in. Okay. Alright, that was two blood bones and two souls. Alright, got an either. We got another bot. Okay. Um, you'd like me to have this one too, right? Ah, you're picking it up, of course. Now just keep that creepy face and yours going. Okay, now they're blue. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, what? I didn't kill them all. Oh, because I didn't learn Blizzard Blizzard. I might make this an extra long video, let's see. She has finally learned Blizzard! I, I did it. Are you seriously trying there? I'm sorry. I'm not looking for an apology or anything. I'll try even harder from now on. So, so teach me more, pal, please. Can I ask you a question? Yes, what is it? A need pop shouldn't need to know black magic for a job. So why are you so set on learning this stuff? I want to further my mind and spirit. Troy is a peaceful nation and sea pops aren't supposed to be fighting battles. But there's something weird going on in this land, you know? This ring and a bell for you at all. Don't want to talk about it, I see. Oh. So next up is Thunder, right? Ah, let's get started. Thunder, Rain, Clouds, Lightning. Hey, she's learning. Okay, okay, that's enough. So we're going to use, we're going to learn thunder with a question mark. You're certainly getting into the swing of things now. Thank you very much. Don't get too confident. This is usually the point where people let their egos sink them. Uh, yes, I understand. So on this floor, there's yellow jellies, which are weak to thunder. Ooh.
So it's not better, but that's cool. We can use that to cure each other if we need to. Uh, we don't need to. Alright, that's two blood bones and two skeletons. Alright, now we're gonna start doing the maze thing, because it's gonna get mazy. Alright, we got a tent and echo herbs. Alright, back along this this way up to the stairs. All uh, right, here we go. We got our three yellow jellies. So we're gonna go ahead and hit them with Thundara because I want them all to die. All right. Should be a short path here. Hopefully not too many fights. That was four yellow jellies. Charlie. Hold on, sir. So this should be a Sage's Miter, which we're going to go ahead and give the Lenora. Um, which raises her defense and magic defense. Alright. That was two blood, blood bones and two souls. Alright, we will learn Protect. Right, so we need... I'm going to use Kira. All right, that was a blood bone, two skeletons, and a spirit. Front door open. All right, and boom. You can probably guess what we're about to fight. You're up again. I won't let my ego get the best of me. Don't tell me, show me. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna hit them all with thunder. It's probably not gonna kill them all because, you know. Why would it do that? Okay. We're on, you know, we're actually almost done with this dungeon, so I'm gonna go ahead and go for it. We're at 32 minutes, but I'm gonna be cutting out a lot of it, so I think we'll be out. Place. You should be listening to mom, not just me, buddy. Lenora has learned thunder. All right. I did it. Well, you've now officially mastered the basics of black magic. But don't think that's the end of it. You've only just made it to the starting line. Yes, Palum. Black magic is all about knowing the properties of things, their weaknesses and strengths, which magic works best against what type of target. You need to have that knowledge drilled into you. Yes, it's all a matter of training as it goes. That's right, and if you don't have a natural talent for it, you'll just have to work that much harder. All right, so we're on the seventh floor. All right, that was three red mooses and three yellow jellies. So I hit them with lightning. So there's four switches here. We want to hit all of them except for the upper left. Wait. One blood bones and three skeletons. So in here, you want to hit all of the buttons except for the upper left. We got a remedy. It's going to unlock treasures. Remedy. Cottage. Herm sandal. Really? All right. That was two gargoyles. Okay. Hold on. I dry either, decoy, and a sager surplus. All right, that was two blood bones, a spirit, and a soul. Not 100% sure what I'm doing here, but I have, oh, wait, I think you gotta talk to this, come on. All right, that was three red mooses and three red yellow jellies. So we just gotta talk, there's actually no boss here. 
Uh, this looks like the top floor. Y yes, it is. Let's see here. The monastic seal is the very word etched on the plinth. Oh, that's really stupid. So simply getting here is good enough? And that's all you need to do to be a Trojan epop. Then you have to wonder what kind of stop it, please. Huh? You can say whatever you want to about me. I don't care. But when it comes to the epops, I won't just stand here and let you insult them right in front of my face. Lenore. I love how gentle and kind everyone in Troll has been to a stranger like me. Maybe it doesn't seem like much of some magical prodigy like you, but... Uh, sorry, I wasn't trying to make fun of him. But listen, you're probably a lot better off without any natural talent. If you're a prodigy, then all that happens is you get lazy and quit pushing yourself to improve. Hello? I'm just saying, don't let yourself be satisfied with what where you are now, okay? Anyway, let's head back. You've got any pop post to fill. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and leave it here. Um, I think this is a great place to stop. Um, it's uh, So until next time, adios amigos.